Hello and uh, good morning once again. Uh, thank you and welcome to uh, African Ark Ministry, Yahweh Sanctuary. This is Rabbi Afol once again uh, with you. Uh, I've just started a project and I wish to do some videos on a very, very uh, important topic. Uh, this this is involves uh, the Holy Pentacles, as uh, Anne Arriva really said. The Holy Pentacles are pentacles dedicated to the Holy Angels, and he said once you have them with you, you'll be secured throughout your whole life. In fact, the truth of it is that these pentacles have accounted for most of the works that I have been doing and it has proven itself very effective and it has blasted power when I mean blasted power it has proven to be very effective in most of the jobs that I have done with these uh, holy pentacles they are known as the pentacles of Solomon King Solomon and uh, those that can be found in the greater key of Solomon. The truth of the matter is that we have other uh, pentacles that are not dedicated to the holy angels. They are pentacles that are dedicated to, let me say, um, uh, non benevolent angels. Non benevolent angels. But this particular one I'm dealing with right now is how to work with the holy pentacles of solomon i've gone through other sites and i've really found out that nobody is teaching the red way to assess these pentacles i've taken it upon myself as a project to start from the scratch and to teach how one can assess the power from these pentacles i assure you they are very powerful tools to use uh, in our spiritual work and they are very effective they are very effective <coughs> they will they, anyone who uses them in conjunction with their various psalms and with the other uh, angels connected with these these uh, holy pentacles will be able to realize most of their uh, desire i'm talking of these these are the holy pentacles. This one is there for Jupiter. Jupiter. Ju the Jupiterian seals. I wish to teach how you can really construct them, how you can consecrate them, how you can put them to use in various ways to achieve your various ends. Um, this particular one, this particular one, is the first pentacle of Jupiter. And this first pentacle of Jupiter is good for people who engage in businesses. And this sort of controls or directs the energies of the planet Jupiter for us to use. And they are governed by four angels, which is <coughs> Netoniel, Divachia, Sidikea Parasiel and these are their names written in Hebrew at the four corners of the seals, I mean around the verticals. You can see the four names of the angels. So this particular seal can be used in directing the force of the, uh, the angels or the force of the, the planets. So it, you can use it in conjunction with any other uh, Jupiterian seal you see here. Some of the seals are for wealth, others are for driving away poverty, others are for protection, others are for obtaining vision. And I wish to teach how one can really uh, start using these seals. What you have to do is that you have to get the seals printed out. You print them out on the day of Jupiter and on the hour of Jupiter. 
The day of Jupiter is Thursday. The hour of Jupiter, you can look, you can calculate it with some of the uh, uh, planetary apps or planetary calculator on the on the internet. You can calculate the the correct hour. So, in printing of the seal, you need to print it on the day of Jupiter. Supposing you want to work with the Jupiterian seal. And Jupiter is governed is, is, is governed by Thursday. Thursday. The planet Jupiter is governed by Thursday. The angel is Sashiel. Or in certain circles, Zadikiel. So what happens is that you print this scene on that very day, Thursday. Not only on Thursday, but on the hour of Thursday. And during this time, the moon should be in full convulsion, meaning that it should be the moon should be increasing, or it should be waxing. It should be waxing. It means you don't do it when the moon is waning, but rather when it is waxing. You print the seal out. You can. You have two options. You can print it on the color blue. The color blue is the color of Jupiter. Or you can print it and color it with a crayon, blue. In fact, printing a seal on its day and on its hour gives the seal some energy to start with. You have already gotten some power to start with. Because once you print a Venus seal on a Friday and then on the hour of Venus, the seal has already taken some power. In actual fact, in the in the greater key of Solomon, it is said that these seals can be printed on the, the day of Mercury, which is Wednesday, and at the hour of Mercury, which is uh, Wednesday at the hour of Mercury. You can print all the seals. But I have personally found out that in printing the seals, if you print them on their day and on their hour, they, they acquire some amount of energy or power. The next thing you do is to color it in the rare color, which is blue. If it is, for example, Venus, you print, you color it green, or you print it on a green, on a green, uh, you use a green, a4 sheet. Now I have here a yellow, yellow. I think this is a bit light, but this could be used for Sunday, which is the day of the sun, governed by Michael. And so, for example, if I want to print a sun seal, I will wait on a Sunday at the hour of the sun and have it printed out. I will use my printer here to print it out. Immediately I've done that, the seal has gotten some power. Those of you who do not have the, uh, the correct color paper can move ahead and then shade with the crayon yellow and it's acceptable. Once you have your seal in this way, the next step is how to consecrate it. How to consecrate it. In the consecration, you can draw a circle on the floor in which you will sit you will sit within with a frank incense and with your candle and consecrate it with the various sounds I will give the various sounds that is recited in the consecration and finally as you have, as you have passed the seal through the smoke of the frank incense and recited the various psalms that I will mention here. Then you recite the oration. The oration is the final step of it. After you have recited the oration, the seal gets concentrated and it's ready to be used in any form. Various books, various books have shown a different method. This is one of the books that I use. And this book is also very excellent. It's a very excellent book in using. 
I want to demonstrate in our next lesson how to use the various um, various psalms and the various method. I'll demonstrate how the seals can be consecrated and put to good use. I suppose I've been a blessing today and this project has just started and by the time we get to the end of this, you will be able to achieve anything you want on this planet. Just like Anne Arriva said, he said, you can get anything, I mean anything, with the use of these powerful seals. Thank you fellow comrades for listening to me. This is the beginning of it. Please subscribe and follow because the good news is that I'm on my way to teach this hidden, the hidden method to these seals. I wish that each and every one who will listen to me will be able to assess them and use them to, for their own good. Stay blessed and thank you for being with me. This is Rabbi Afur from Ewutu Biasi. Thank you and stay blessed. Shalom, shalom, shalom. Peace. Baruch Hashem.